Welcome to the Mind Sanity Podcast. What's up, guys? My name is Eric, aka Azrael Eternity, and welcome to the Mind Sanity Podcast. With us today, Grave Walker. Hey, yo. Banjo Bates. Hi, guys. And a much caffeinated, caffeinated <laughs> sick <cord. laughs> Apparently, I not, need some. Yes, he's not caffeinated enough. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, for the week of, what is today? Uh, May 28th. Um, yeah, that. Memor- Memorial Day was just yesterday. Did you guys do anything for Memorial Day? Slept. I packed. worked. Slept, worked, and packed. Wow. I'm the only mm-hmm. thing that I, the only one that, uh, I went to a military cemetery for, uh, my wife's grandfather, mm-hmm. who was buried there. Put down some yeah, flowers. They- that was about the only day off I've had in a very long time, so I slept. <laughs> uh, my wife Anyhow. was apparently unaware that there's a distinction between Memorial Day and Veterans Day, in that Memorial Day is specific to uh, servicemen that died during duty. Mm-hmm. Uh, I thought Memorial Day was about the presidents. No. What? That would be that President's would be Day. Day. Yeah. Well, no, I mean like um. I thought that we used to celebrate Lincoln, uh, Washington, and someone else's, someone else, some other president's birthday. That would be President's Day. And we just combine them. President's Day. Yeah. 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 Washington and Lincoln. Both. (laughs) Okay. (laughs) Well done, Banjo. I'm tired. Welcome to America. What school system do you go to? (laughs) (laughs) The The American one? The (laughs) United Oh, wow. He even said America. (laughs) I said the American. He did say American. I heard that part. (laughs) No, 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 no. no. Hmm. But still, it's it's the United States school system. (laughs) It's America. 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 We're America. From America. This this brings up a very good point that I've seen repeatedly, uh, recently at least. People who have English as a second language speak it perfectly. Mm-hmm. Anyone from America, well, um, <laughs> not so much. Go there. Not so yeah. much. <laughs> it's uh, like, I can't understand you. And they're just like, same here. <laughs> um, well, no. Did you know that there was a distinction between the United States and these United States? What? The, what we commonly refer to as the United States was actually re- originally referred to as these United States. Hmm. In that they were however many separate entities forming one nation, as opposed to one nation comprised of 50 different states. It's kind of like the, U- the United Nations. Everything hmm. is part of a whole, and you refer to the collective as the United Nations. Whereas... Hmm. You know, and the United we refer to all the states now as the United States, instead of referring to them as these, which means that they're individual states comprising of. Well, I'm moving to Texas, so it's officially America. <laughs> and W. <laughs> you can you can have your America with W. Um, Oi. George W. Bush. Yeah. Oi. <laughs> That's all I'm going to say. Just oi. Oi. <laughs> yeah. Um. So yeah, Jorge W. Bush. <laughs> Jorge. <laughs> okay, um, then. Do you gotta moving, speak your part of Spanish. <laughs> Spanglish. Yeah, you, you, you know, you know, you know Spanish, right? Uh, I see. Okay, I, I, I don't want to sound offensive, um, but how many, how many Hispanic or Latino people are there up in Alaska, Sigs? <laughs> You would be surprised. Half of my son's uh, soccer team is Mexican. Well, that that doesn't surprise me that the soccer team, but I mean, like, percentage of... <laughs> uh, uh, <laughs> I, I, come on now. I'm not uh, he, he's um, right, though. I mean... I, yeah. Well, I, I live in California, so I'm <laughs> white and a minority here, so... Um, that's why. I'm, I'm just curious, because, I mean, I don't know percentages like i know california is heavily hispanic all this all the states that border mexico are heavily hispanic um if you go up to like north dakota or michigan or anything like that it's much lower uh, population density it's a lot more canada latino Latino. uh yes a lot more canadia canadias canadia canadia um 
<laughs> You're just having trouble today, aren't you? <laughs> uh, I'm hearing a lot of oys. Yeah. You want to talk about it? <laughs> Not with you. <laughs> <laughs> Anywhere but here. Come on, Grave. It could be. It could be therapeutic to share it with all six of our viewers. <laughs> Of all which six. we're four. <laughs> <laughs> Shh! They don't need to know! Uh, the other two bad. don't need to know! I think they know. <laughs> <laughs> Subscriber list! Uh, wow, I, I, I recognize these people. These are the ones <laughs> that are on the podcast. Oh, <laughs> uh, Hey, you know what? At least we're popular with ourselves. <laughs> that says a lot. Hey. <laughs> Uh, speaking oh. of popular people, uh, we just got added a new player to both servers, both Mind Sandy mm -hmm. and the Sigcraft server. Uh, the Redstone no, however, he Dock. hasn't logged in. He hasn't logged into Vanilla, has he? Um, he logged in, but I don't think he's actually done anything. Yeah, he. I think he's waiting for his mic. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, but he has been very active and very talkative on the uh, Sigcraft <laughs> server. Uh, yes, he FTB. is. Um, but he has a lot of good ideas, and he know, he's, uh, as the name implies, a redstone genius from what um, King has told us about him. From Germany. From Germany, yes. So that oh. is one of the reasons why he is not joining us on the podcast today, is he is already asleep, because it is 1 a.m. there. Yep. Uh, yeah. Uh, offhand, I never, I haven't asked him, and I haven't noticed. Uh, how old is he? I'm assuming approximately he's Andrew's age. Oh, no um, one knows. I don't think anyone um, has any idea at the moment. I, I I know he does go to school, but I didn't bother to ask if that was school or university. So I'm assuming since he's home at a roughly roughly the same hours, um, if you count time well, changes as me, I'm guessing high school. Gotcha. Don't really know though. So. Yeah, we we'll have no We'll find out, idea. probably. Yeah, we'll find out for you. Uh, we'll find out. We'll pry it from his dead, <laughs> un cold, unliving hands. I mean, we'll ask him nicely. Um, I'm not sure. Okay. Anyways. Okay. Uh, ban you Banjo guys were playing too much hidden. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I was gonna Apparently. Say, I was going to say that he's, you know, watched the Purge trailer too many times. I've only seen it twice. Once oh. in the podcast and once on Hulu. <laughs> Oh, okay. Uh, yeah, we talked about that, what, week two? Yeah. Something like that, yeah. Um, initial release uh, was May 2nd, it says. I'm just a generally violent person. <laughs> IMD no. says that it's a 6.7 uh, six six out of 10. That is <laughs> unfortunate. Anyways. Um, yeah. We well, I'm not seeing that one now. <laughs> I, I think I might wow. see it. I think I might still go see it, but I think I might wait for it to be at the uh, $3 theater that's in town. <laughs> oh, wow, you have a $3 theater? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, we, we've got one. Um, we have Jeez. a regular theater, which is like friggin' $10 a ticket, and then... Ours we're... is 20 bucks a ticket! What? Yeah. Are you watching, that like, like a friggin'... Off. What, are you no, watching, like, on movies. IMAX or something? No, it's regular movies, like, regular definition, regular everything, no 3D. 20 bucks a 20 ticket? 20 bucks a ticket, yeah. Oh my god. Wow. It's not even that bad for me. God. I don't yeah, even know I think, what it... I think, like, the most expensive ticket that you can get in, like, our theaters is, I think, $13 for one of the 3D... For a 3D movie. Okay. Um, by 20 bucks a ticket, I mean, like, 18 <laughs> But, <laughs> but still, that's still, yeah. yeah. Nonetheless. Yeah. It's outrageous. Yeah, I, I, no, I don't disagree. Um, but, like, the theater that we have... It's like 10, 12 bucks a ticket, and uh, once the movies get played out over uh, at that theater, they have a second theater that's actually right, like, two blocks away, um, that's tucked away, that has four screens, I think, and they all play movies for three bucks a pop. Hmm. Um, nice. I saw Battleship there. <laughs> <laughs> was My that wife good? worth three bucks? No. We're we're, we're three bucks. Um, it was yeah. kind of amusing to see uh, Rihanna in the acting role. Oh, <laughs> Wait, well. Rihanna! Rihanna plays in that. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, jeez. Um, she wasn't terrible. I'm all no, that. She, she was not terrible. Um, she's pretty. <laughs> <laughs> no, it was. It honestly wasn't a bad bad movie, and the ending of it uh, I thought was very clever. 
um, they, the, the resolution I, they, for it. They pushed the whole link to the game, though. Yeah. Yeah. Very, that um, was that was the the only part that I thought was kind of like, okay, you guys are stretching. <laughs> yeah. I, I, whenever you start making movies out of board games, I, <laughs> that's about where I draw the line. It, I'm sorry. Well, it was part part the board game, but they actually also. Um, you know, end up going to. Can I? Can I do spoilers? Does anybody care? I don't care. I, I okay. don't think so. We, to a movie that's been out over a year. Yeah, that's fair enough. Uh, <laughs> I don't know. At this point, I think yeah. I have no idea. I should have checked that when I went looked on IMDb, but uh, yeah, it's been out for a while. Okay, so the end of the movie, like the the beginning of the movie, it's like this alien race comes and like blows up um, three or three ships or two ships of. Uh, this joint military exercise fleet um, that gets separated from the rest and they come back they fight the aliens the aliens are trying to destroy everything I can't remember the entire plot line of it but at the end of it they're trying to defeat the aliens with like this antique freaking World War II uh, mm-hmm. battleship yeah an actual battleship <laughs> an actual of battleship a yeah and uh, the way they end up doing it is like pretty hilarious that they have all these guns loaded and the guy drops one of the anchors and it makes the ship like essentially fishtail yeah and it Mm. swings the guns into position when the aliens aren't expecting it and it just blows the fuck out of it yeah (laughs) sounds like a pretty good description it it, yeah it was it was an interesting ending i'm not gonna lie i thought it was kind of fun (laughs) Like you cheered blowing the, the shit out of them, blowing the shit out of the aliens. Isn't that what it's all about? I mean, come on, look at how in- well Independence Day did. <laughs> well, Independence Day had Will Ferrell. In it. That's completely different. Will Ferrell? You mean Will Smith? Will Smith. Wow. 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 I'm tired. <laughs> okay. <Apparently. laughs> There's a big difference there. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm just like Will Ferrell. I'm like, I'm, I'm racking my brain, going, I don't even. Was he even like an actor at that was, point? Was, was he just, a high school? <laughs> I think he was still probably at that point. I think he was still probably on SNL. S- SNL, yeah. <laughs> but, I... Boy, we uh, definitely jumped off on a tangent there. <laughs> yes, we did. Yeah. Yeah. Three dollars to the anything but Minecraft podcast. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> uh, sure, sure. I, news? Uh, other sure. server news, I guess. Speaking, speaking yeah, speaking of. Minecraft. I mean, I have not touched the vanilla server. I think, and probably since the last podcast, <laughs> I've been trying wow. to. Fi- I w- I've been trying to figure out the life of me what to do next. But it's just like FTB. That's what I should need to do next. I need to do FTB. <laughs> uh, um, I I am struggling with bees right now. I can't get Imperials for the life of me. <sighs> yeah, I, I saw your little filter system. <laughs> Down at the bottom of your mountain. What about it? Uh, I didn't quite understand it, but I was just like, okay, well, that makes sense. Sure. It, it's mm-hmm. a pipe. It's yeah. A pipe. It's a pipe. <laughs> um, it works because I told it to. <laughs> <laughs> I'm currently in the process of moving all of my shit down into my hole in the ground. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you've gotten a hole in the ground. Yeah, I, I had a... I basically... My, okay, my mountain, like, where I had the quarry was at Y118. I have... I quarried... Or, excuse me, where the top is. I quarried out all the way down to level 12. <laughs> oh. Which took forever. Yeah. Um, but... It's all done, and it's... Uh, I'm starting to fill stuff in, and I built a my blaze farm into one of the walls uh, and it will be auto collecting blaze rods for me to eventually be fel- fill fueling to fill generators for fuel don't be stealing my ideas <laughs> he definitely had that idea first I was going to say that that was something that um, I, I, Banjo reminded me of like day two <laughs> well, no, I'm like oh yeah on... you can burn those things for fuel <laughs> On the My Insanity FTB server, the original one, uh, that was something that Grave had. He had a big tower yeah. that had. Yeah. Uh, but. Yeah. In any case. <laughs> yeah. Had an array of like 12 generators. 
something like that. But you know that that map got corrupted, so who yeah. cares? <laughs> but essentially, well, what I'm doing is I have nine nine by nine room with water sources in each corner, so it forces everything into the middle. And mm. in the middle, I have an obsidian pipe, pipe, and then an ender chest. Um, and then I'm going to have an ender chest down at the bottom hooked up to some sort of engine um, that will constantly be, you know, when items in with an, a gate, thankfully, because I took a couple of gates from Banjo. Well, crap. <laughs> I used your, pro your uh, table. And when that was I'm in the non-public region, Asriel. I don't know what you think you are. Yeah. <laughs> you generate that power. Able for free. to kick you from the server. <laughs> Not that one. <laughs> not that server. Well, not <laughs> another one. Another one. Um, <laughs> but got a couple of uh, gates and I made myself little gates. Little but the gates. gates. The gates will detect when there's items in inventory and it'll pump out uh, and distribute the uh, those stuff. Yeah, <laughs> I need coffee. I I probably should make uh. some. Um. Then we'd have to restart again. No, I'm not gonna <laughs> nah. make any. I'm not gonna make any coffee. I do. I do have soda somewhere. Probably could just drink that. But. Um. So yeah. Yeah, <laughs> that's what I'm working on. Is, um, I did record my episode four today already, uh, introducing the idea of the uh, rise Thing. of the capital. Mm -hmm. Oh, cool. And. It was a very short video, but it was kind of like, okay, this is what I'm doing. This is the... I don't know if you guys have been over to my place recently, but I built an actual village. Oh, nice. Up there. That was my question my, uh, is, do you have cheaty armor? I yes. do have cheaty armor. We all have cheaty armor. <sighs> You're me. welcome. And even Redstone Doc has cheaty armor. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, uh, actually, Sigs, now that I have a matter fabricator, I'm definitely going with the uh, gravity suit. <laughs> Why? I well, hate I... the flying on the stupid power suits. Oh, I don't disagree. Um, I, I like the. F I hate the flying. On um, the power suits. What? Do you have the uh, advanced flight control in it? Yes, and I hate oh, how okay. you can't just like look down and go forward. Okay. Okay. I was gonna say because. I, I like control? it. Okay, I need to look into that. <laughs> yeah, it basically it acts just like hover mode. Or it is literally creative mode flying. No, it oh, isn't. Okay. <laughs> if the if you've part. ever if you've ever used um, single player commands flying, that's what it's like. Yeah, that. Okay. Yeah. Except to go it's up. Really, and it, it, it goes in the direction you're looking. Which is except nice. Up. Except up. It, it's nice, except for when you're trying to fly in a straight direction, or you're trying to build something, and you're zipping around all over the place and not going to the right area. It can get really annoying. Yeah, I can imagine. Um, I don't particularly worry about it that much. I don't, I don't fly a lot and try to build. Well, I mean, I was, I was just trying to put a lever on a freaking tier 5 creeper spawner to get some gunpowder and it could not, could not for the life of me. Oh, did you get that set up then? No, I, it's still at my place. I need to move that. But I don't want to do it now because that's going to be a lot of clicking. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Fair enough. We appreciate that. <laughs> <laughs> um, I'm still not sure what else I'm going to be. I, ha I still have a tier 5 cow spawner um, at my mind. Oh, you do? Yeah. Yeah. There's um, one at the spawn now. Is uh, there? I, I haven't been... Yeah, to, at I, the, you guys the don't. You get... <sighs> Oh God! Why do I why do I bother to put anything on Skype? I swear to God. <laughs> <laughs> did you put it on Skype? Uh, I said sure. yes. Yeah, this is your, uh, yeah. Yes, you I did. did. I remember that. I I, did I, not I, I like having my own stuff because <laughs> then I don't oh, have no, to. I, I'm, I'm dropping one of my base too, so I mean. <laughs> I don't like to share. <laughs> Sharing sucks. Uh, wow. Oh. <sighs> But, no, 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 no. but uh, <laughs> yeah, so there is one downtown. Uh, I dropped one using a couple of my little golem, well, four of my little golem buddies, and it auto cooks the steak and pulls the leather out. Oh, is that, <clears throat> that's is that similar to the one that you had on the previous? Yeah, Jeez. yeah, minus minus the chickens, basically. Okay. I ha I have a cheer five chicken. I think if you would like it. Oh, I have one of those too. 
Okay. <laughs> we're all, he has tier 5 we're... everything. Well, not quite, but working on it. <laughs> I'm tempted to make a tier 5 creeper, but I don't think that I need... How... Well, industrial TNT you need a lot of in the late game, don't you? Yeah, I'm using yes. a ton of it to make diamonds. You can make diamonds out of gunpowder? No, 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 I'm oh. saying industrial TNT. Oh, okay. I'm getting diamond dust. Mmm. Okay. From silk touching diamond ore and then grinding it. Macerating it. Yeah. Uh, or, no, no, industrial grinder. grinder yeah. yeah. Industrial That's grinder, right. yeah. You have. God, I, I wish that I had as good a grasp of FTB as, like, you do, Banjo. Or I have zero idea what I'm doing. Yeah. <laughs> you have well, you, well enough that you have, like, a very high supply of energy. Okay, I have maybe three. Um, <laughs> three understandings. <laughs> All three. Uh, if, if, okay. If, if, if he can keep his stuff from blowing up, he, he'd be doing good. Yeah. You I know did. what? I made a matter fabricator <laughs> twice in one day, and I was about to scream. I think all three of you would have heard me scream. Uh, oh God. I I screamed when I broke my industrial electrolyzer. I will say that. Because those that things thing, are easy. And it's easy compared to a matter fabricator. Yes. But it's a pain in the butt because then you have to you have to make three individual machines and then make another machine on top of that. Yeah, but the three, three individual machines are so easy. I'm not saying it's not easy, Banjo. I'm saying that it's annoying and tedious. Yes. <laughs> I'll, I'll give you some fabricators, though. Ooh, ooh, those, th I, those things make it easy. I, ha I have fa two fabricators. I can make more. Okay. Um, I have the supplies. <laughs> I overjudged how many... I didn't realize that... Uh, engineering blocks are made in packs of, in groups of four, <laughs> so I made sixteen. <laughs> yeah. So I already have two fabricators and enough to make two more. Um, what else? Oh, what was I just thinking of? Oh, I did. I just realized today that uh, well, early today last night, um, that bozite takes a shite ton of energy. Yes. I did what not realize bozite? that. Boxite, oh, well, bozite. bauxite. I say oh, bauxite. bauxite. I say bozite. Because it is French. Fancy. Huh? It is French. Just trying to be all fancier. Okay, I'm going to freaking look up how to pronounce bozite. <laughs> <laughs> how to pronounce bozite. It's technically bozite. Yeah, I think it is. Um, let's see. Right. Is, there, is there a thing that says how to pronounce it? No? I doubt that there would be, honestly. Oh, come on. There has to be. I can ring up my uh, Canadian friend who speaks French. <laughs> <laughs> that would make him French Canadian. Yes, but still Canadian. It would also help if I put the word pronounce in my search. My search was how to bozite. <laughs> <laughs> Very carefully. Um... Boxite. Oh, okay, man. website that I just had said boxite. Yeah. That's. I might have, that's a while ago I said it, but... In I French, don't you don't pronounce yeah. X's. I say well, bozite. I like it better that way. It's it's okay. like it's yeah. like saying lupus right. instead of lapis. Oh, God. <laughs> well, that's just a pure <laughs> ignorance kind of thing. No, that's a running joke is what it is. Yeah. Um, as far as on the Minecraft server. I don't participate in it. <sighs> I, I say bozite. Anyways, uh... But yeah, Bozite's a pain in the ass. 256,000 EU to do 12 Bozite into its materials. And you have to use Bozite because it's the only way to make titanium. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> and it's like You would not believe how long I had to wait to get another 4 titanium to get the matter fab up again. Oh, I, I can only imagine. <laughs> I currently have, I think, four or five uh, titanium dust uh, that I need to come over to Banjo's and use his equipment and make it into ingots, but... Uh, uh, it, <laughs> you know, oh, something else that I discovered today? Lapatron crystals, you can use sapphires. Yes, you can. Yeah. And I, for energy, the energy crystals, you can use the rubies. Oh! Yes, you don't have to waste diamonds for nothing! Oh my god. That makes me, that makes me so happy. I didn't even realize that one. Yeah, you have like a stack and a half of diamonds, Mr. Fancy. Well, that's because I friggin' camped the Ender chest or the Enderman farm. <laughs> and I need to do the bunch. 
I am all out of like gold and diamonds. And it, running it, well, iron. It, it's funny. I, 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 you know, I complained to you guys about being cheaty, and yet I was the one who built the Ender Farm a week and a half, not even a week and a half into the server being up and running. No, <laughs> <laughs> and, and admittedly, that 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 gave us the jump. The, the yeah, yeah, to be able to jump uh, forward on everything and yeah. I have no regrets. No regrets. Without four thousand yeah. iron, I wouldn't have been able to make any of my uh, advanced machines. So. <laughs> I spent about that much iron just on my armor. Huh. Which is weird, because you and I have the exact same armor set. <laughs> uh, more or less, yeah. I like Mine's the probably division. just a little bit more optimized. I actually don't have that installed. I choose I have, to not for I some reason. It, I have it installed and I have it keybinds. Um, yeah, I, I should probably do that. What do you have? The night vision. Eh. On the helmet. Oh, huh. it's helpful. Um, yeah, I would think so. I just know if I had that, I would never put torches down anywhere. And yeah. <laughs> that is true. Yeah, that is a problem. Yeah, I don't think that would end very well. <laughs> Newsflash: Asriel needs a freaking spawn book at his place. I have one in the portal. What? It goes through. Your portal is disabled. No, it's not. I fixed it. I fixed it today. Well, shit, that I'm in the middle of nowhere running back to spawn for nothing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and plus there's a port. There's always been a portal, but it's down on the beach. Like, if you walked through the frame of my portal, you would see the uh, other portals that have generated down on the beach. <laughs> yeah, I noticed those. No, what I do need is I need a book to the... Uh... Whatchamafuck-it. Nether that hub? thing. The, the nether, nether hub. hub. Okay. The nether okay. hub. That's what I need to get a book to. Um, the what you need... fuck it. Yeah. Okay. I need to get, also get rid of a bunch of the freaking books that I have for my for the mining world <laughs> that I don't ever <laughs> use. Um. Oh, could somebody please explain to me uh, about? Well, maybe do it later. But about about redstone energy conduit. You need a, a magma crucible and a liquid uh, transposer. Transfer, and, yeah. Yeah, I have I have those. No, it's it's mm -hmm. not like the process of making it. It's because um, I currently have problems with you know I use I have engines pumping into a redstone energy cell, mm -hmm. and then from the energy cell I have conductive uh, pipes going to my machines. You can and, conductive pipes go boom. Yes, exactly. Now, if you use redstone and conduct or the redstone. Pipe. Conduits. Conduits. Thank you. Um, do they still pull energy if there's not a use for it? No. No. Okay, no, they that's... just store it a ton. Yeah, that's 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 what I saw at Banjo's place. So that's why what was making me curious about it. So now, today, I'm going to be going and making more <laughs> making redstone uh, energy conduits. The only downside is like it takes obsidian, like pulverized obsidian, the hardened glass. We well, can make um... obsidian. With um, two logs and the yeah the, trans uh, transmuting yeah. logs yeah which I have a crap ton of now thanks to uh, banjo uh, hmm? because why well, the harvester that I saw at your place ah uh, yes that thing is amazing yes do you have the planter too yes I yeah. just don't have the uh, the fertilizer other thing <laughs> yeah I'm doing that a lot today so don't mind me. <laughs> <laughs> Don't mind me, just having mental aneurysms. <laughs> um, okay. Aneurysms? Isn't that the thing? No. The thing with the thing? Aneurysms make you die. Yeah, aneurysms are, yeah. You're a blood clot in your brain of? bursting. Yeah. Yeah, that, that's not what I'm thinking of. What is it called? Conniption? No, that's not it either. Uh, how no. About, how would we just say a brain fart? <laughs> okay. Yeah, that works. Yeah, that works. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Similar to sound complex, and then S similar to Sigs, who is an old fart. <laughs> <laughs> oh, th that was sorry. <laughs> hey, I said earlier that we need to stop picking on banjo so much. <laughs> no, I hey. actually had I had a really good idea that because uh, we were always talking about that we want to do more group events, and one of them that I had was a two v two v two v two on the walls. 
with the four of us on two different teams, and then four people from four corners on two mm-hmm. different teams, and we each have a you know two people. And I was gonna pair up with six. And oh really? Him. So you're yeah. gonna leave me with banjo? Banjo. <laughs> uh. Hey, I, 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 I don't want to put. Bro. I don't want to have to put banjo. Have Sigs have to put up with banjo. <laughs> Yeah. I don't want to torture but, uh, the guy. You and I, you and I could always, you know. No, around. not not gonna happen. <laughs> no, me, oh, me yeah. and Sigs for team old guys. <laughs> <laughs> uh, um, though I, I technically I'm not. I'm not even the second oldest. I'm the third, aren't I? <laughs> yeah. yeah. I think King. King's older than you, isn't he? Yeah, and you're older than him. But yeah, King, I King we can't get to do group events. <laughs> No, because he no. has, he has the mid shift every single day. <laughs> oh, that's why I was run into him. Okay, yeah, he's that's why he's he such a, he's a night owl. He's a he works yeah. nights, and he comes home on his lunch <laughs> and plays Minecraft. Does he? Well, yeah, he does. More, I think more he AFKs. <laughs> no, 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 no. He comes. No, home. lately he's been AF, AFKing. Okay, he does come home from work <laughs> to play Minecraft because I've been playing, and he's like, yeah, all right, I'm on my lunch. Gotta go. <laughs> He'll be on for like half an hour. It's like, okay. He that's... could always just bring his computer with him. <laughs> to Walmart? A laptop. Laptop, well, you know. Yeah. yeah. Well, no, he definitely does not have a laptop because he has two, no, three SLI video cards. Jesus. Um, They're all really crappy video cards. <laughs> oh, wow. Uh, well, he he just had a, I don't know if you saw on Twitter, yeah, his Twitter that he had a saw that. computer breakdown. Oh, really? Um, yeah, oh, so crappy. He's, Apparently he's getting a new one. He's going to be getting a new one. He's got it back up and running, uh, but he's going to mm. be getting another one. So, yeah. oh, that's what you get for shopping at Walmart. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm not the Was that one. supposed to be a diss on Walmart? Yes. Okay, just making they, sure. They sell inferior quality goods. I bought a uh, printer from them on Black Friday. It was a nineteen dollar nineteen dollar printer. <laughs> Why would and you I, ever do that? Because <laughs> it was nineteen bucks, and my wife wanted her own printer. For some reason, our wireless one she doesn't want. <laughs> want you don't use. like your wife? <laughs> <laughs> I, it's not that I bought it for her. Uh, I I took an elbow to the ribs to get it for her. <laughs> Yikes! Well, it was on a pallet and. Uh, they cut the pallet, and that was one of the things that we were, we were mostly going for. And so I was, like, pre-positioned. I was like, okay, I know that this is the printer. Ready to jump. And some guy shoved in in front of me and elbowed me in the ribs, and I uh, kicked him in the knee. <laughs> <laughs> uh, There's a reason I don't go out on Black Friday. I, I uh. haven't gone out for the past two years. Um it's just not worth it. I mean, I'm not even going for anything <laughs> specifically. I don't go for the TVs or the laptops or the computers or anything like that. I'm mostly going for, oh, the $5 DVDs that they normally sell are now $4 or are now $3. Yeah. I mostly go for the movies. We... Yeah. And you get to watch people we run over, apparently. Yeah. No, it, well, that's it is a Black Friday tradition. It, it is yeah. quite possibly the most hilarious thing to watch because the Walmart that we've gone to is a 24 hour Walmart. Ooh. Um, and so they have all of their Black Friday deals on pallets in the middle of aisles, black wrapped, which is, you know, it's stretch, stretch wrap that's black. So you can't see what's underneath it. And oh, so there are cruel. Yeah. So everything is black wrapped. You can't tell what it is. And people are like puddling around all of these different things. And then like right before midnight hits, you hear over the radios and people yelling a countdown. Five, four, <laughs> three, two, one, cut and run. Like, that's actually what the supervisors say. <laughs> Cut and run. And literally, it is the the employee that is standing by those pallets, because there's one at each pallet, takes a box cutter, cuts down the plastic, rips off as much of it as, it can, as they can, and hauls ass away from it. <laughs> because it quite oh, yeah. literally turns into a mob in three seconds. That is funny. <laughs> That's terrifying. It's funny. It, it, yeah. is, it is terrifying, but it's quite hilarious to watch when you're not one of the people that's out of power. <laughs> uh... the, the only thing we'll go out for is, like, 
if we're buying Legos and they happen to have whatever Legos are on sale, because my yeah. boys love Legos, and so well, you know you can get like the big Legos. sets, you know the hundred and fifty dollars sets for like seventy five bucks. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So it's, that's... it's crazy how much like how much those prices the prices of Legos have gone up since I was a kid, oh my which God. isn't that long ago. I mean, this is. 15 years? What, what, how old am I? Yeah, I turned, <laughs> turned 27 this year. So yeah, about 15 years. 15, 17 years. Um, and the prices were, you know, super reasonable back then. Who is... What is that noise? Somebody's hmm? cutting? It must have been Banjo. No, not me. I heard <laughs> yeah. it too. Had to have been grave then, because... No, look at me. Keyboard. Or don't talk. It, it sounded like somebody was cutting something. Anyways, um... <laughs> it sounded more like someone was moving something around, but anyway. Is Banjo hey cutting now. his one facial hair. Um, oh. I'm, I'm, spreading I'm spreading the love. I'm spreading the love. I'm spreading the love. Yeah, Lego sets are hugely, insanely expensive now. I can't yeah, but yeah. then again, so is everything else. Well, oh, but yeah. it, no. Legos have jumped up probably like 100% in price versus what they were when I was a kid. Yeah, you know, a gallon of milk hasn't expect? gone up that much. You know, <laughs> it's, but it's it's absolutely well. Yeah, ridiculous. that's because of all the hormones they pump into the cows now. Yeah, Oops. no, <laughs> I, I mine don't have hormones. Thank you. Well, yeah, uh, but a hormonal cow can bring more milk. Yeah. This conversation is gonna get real yeah. bad real fast. <laughs> I shouldn't have brought up milk. <laughs> 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 um, I... Madre. <laughs> Anyways. Ma but yeah, Madre Dios. <laughs> yeah, yeah, something like that. Te voy a puñalar con un cuchillo. Hey. <laughs> Did you actually understand that, Sigs? Oh, uh, most of it. <laughs> <laughs> the fun part? Yeah. Uh, for, for, for those that are curious, uh, I said, I'm going to stab you with a knife. <laughs> Uh, okay. I, I had a I had a Spanish teacher in high school. He actually said that he doesn't teach Spanish; he teaches Mexican. Um, and he, okay. as long as you didn't there's ask him, there's a difference. Him, yeah, there is. There's a huge difference. Um, if, if he said, as long as you don't ask me some how to say some a swear word in Spanish, I will tell you how to say it. And I feel my, like you've said this before. I think I have. Probably. I don't know if I've said it on a podcast though. Uh, I think it was like episode two. Anyway, okay. continue. Anyways, <laughs> I have I am my father's son. I have a habit of repeating myself. <laughs> um, my buddy and I had a used to be technicians for our theater, and we would screw with people by turning the lights on inside of the booth, make stabbing motions at them, and then turning the lights off in the booth. So all of a sudden, they'd be performing on stage. We turn the lights on. We'd they'd see the stabbing motion from coming from us. You know, guys dressed in black, and then the lights would cut out behind us, and just to screw with people. And so it was, you know, I stab you. So I asked him. I was like, "How do you say I stab you?" He was all, "Well, you'd have to actually, you know." say it correctly and you'd say I'm going to stab you and cool. which would be te voy a funilar and then konun cuchillo is with a knife <laughs> you wow. see my Spanish teacher is um, a middle aged mother <laughs> so she, she doesn't like those kind of things around her classroom gotcha yeah. We we had a, a, a substitute teacher several times that was a 70 year old southern woman <laughs> oh my god for Spanish. como se llamas <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm gonna teach y'all. Como se llama? Como se llama? You have to pronounce the L's right. Yama. <laughs> okay. <laughs> it, it was good times. Oh, wow. Good the, times. The funny, one of the one of the fun things about that class was I was in a class with myself four white people, one black guy, and then the other 18 students were Mexicans. Oh. And I had the best grade in the class. Uh, <laughs> Not well, because... Like the Mexicans probably had right better, there. better English than, than you. <laughs> you're, you're right. The Mexicans had poor writing skills in Spanish. They had excellent speaking spill, skills, but had poor writing. Yeah. Hmm. Um... 
So I ended up getting better grades because I could write out my assignments uh, correctly. <laughs> hmm. So it was kind of it was a it was an interesting class. Uh, and then I I oh I I missed an Asian. There was an Asian. I remember. <laughs> Uh, well, there's always well, an Asian. Well, no, the the Asian kid that I that was in the class I played Magic the Gathering with at school, so. <laughs> <laughs> of course he did. Uh, yeah. Thank Ban Banjo. I think you're probably the only one here who doesn't or hasn't at least played that at some point actively. No, I really haven't played any of the nerd games, <laughs> which is odd. Hmm. Eh. Hmm. You didn't play any of the nerd games that weren't on a computer. Yeah. 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 Pen, Probably pen and paper games it. and card games are a thing of the past for the most part. Which is um, kind of unfortunate. It, it is, and it actually is kind of something that's worrisome. And they actually brought it up on Penny Arcade uh, that, you know, they're doing digital trading card games. <laughs> and that scares me because if the game falls out or they stop uh, supporting it, everything the game disappears exactly it's not like you can still play it with your buddies because mm -hmm. you don't have the system to support the digital cards you don't even have the digital cards mm -hmm. whereas <laughs> you know the actual physical things hell there's some of them worth 20 grand well not quite that much but not you know quite that much but i it, I, it's... I there are some magic the gathering cards that are several thousand dollars in value mm -hmm. uh the moxes and the uh Black um, Lotus. Black Lotus. That thing, God. I, I at one point I actually knew how much I it was. Wait, what? I have some of those. I would suggest selling them. No. Or keeping them in extremely good condition. Ah, uh, they are. <laughs> okay. I, I started playing Magic during Beta uh, and like Arabian Nights. Yeah. Time frame. Yeah. So we're talking like ninety-one. You've you're sitting on a little bit of money there. Yeah, <laughs> a little. Sigcor, the resident old guy. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. Well, at and, least and you can, funny, at least you can say thing things. Is, your, oops, go ahead. I was just gonna say, and the funny thing is, is when I go to work, um, for the longest time, I was the baby it, at work. And now I'm. There's one guy who's younger than I am. <laughs> <laughs> so this is a change for me. <laughs> now, out of curiosity, what's the yeah. age difference between yourself and now the new baby? The new baby? Oh, how old is he? He's like it's like five years, four years. Oh, okay, so not that significant. No, pretty pretty much everybody out in the field I work in, we're all like in our thirties. You know, mid 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 to late thirties. Well, though, a couple of our guys are in our their fifties. So, but you know, the the field I work in, it, communications, the equipment we use because it's military. Um, military doesn't get rid of anything. It, yeah, uh, nope. it still works. They use, so we still use. Um, put it this way: we still have. We still have data circuits that run at a 2.4 kilobit. Oh, boy. <laughs> I thought those were just a myth. No. <laughs> 2.4 kilobit. Um, you know, I, yeah. always, I always find it amusing for, uh, for some people, uh, generations older than I am, to be able to say, I am older than the Internet. Have you ever, you should, you should use that on your kids sometime. <laughs> Actually, technically, I'm not. <laughs> when, when, when early seventies. Early seventies, really? Early seventies, yeah. Okay. But yeah. it was just used government agencies and universities, and that's what that was it. It yeah. only became public about ninety four, I believe. Um or no, early, commercial. No. God really? no. Late I just went 80s. to type a Google search and used when was the and the first in, answer first Internet filler. <laughs> yeah, it's internet invented. Uh, and then Great Depression, Civil War, and the Bible written. Uh, <laughs> the internet and uh, the oh, that's a pretty big jump, if you ask me. Yeah. Uh, the development of the internet can be traced back to 1958. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's a pretty old thing. I mean, 
it's not it's not the brand new shiny thing that everybody thinks it is. No, it's not at all. No. It's just, you know, commercially and the way it is now, that's relatively new. Well, I remember using a tw- uh, tw- uh, 1200 baud modem to dial into my buddy's BBS to play <laughs> and post messages and all that fun stuff. Yeah. Oh, I still have a um, phone modem somewhere around here. <laughs> uh, commercial internet service I still providers use work. began to emerge in the late 1980s. Hmm. Yeah, AOL. AOL was around in the 80s. <laughs> yeah. uh, they still are. They, they are? are. Yes, they AOL? are. AOL? Yeah. Never hear anything um, about them. I, t- I told my wife that I, um, I don't know if you guys pay attention to the lottery to the Powerball. Um, the, I played this past weekend. Uh, <laughs> that the six hundred million. Yo, hell yeah! Yeah. <laughs> Call my parents. I'm like, buy me some tickets. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, Powerball was at six hundred million. I think they only had one winner. Um, yeah, they did down, down in, in Florida. Florida. Surprise, and surprise! I was just like, another reason if, to live in Florida. <laughs> why? It's some old person that's not going to be able to use it. <laughs> yeah, and then they give it all away. Yeah. And you're just, you know, the first day of their doorstep. <laughs> I want to take care of you in your old age. <laughs> be a hospice nurse. <laughs> hospice nurse for millionaires. Um, no, I told and my then, wife, I was then... just like, if, if we win this, we're moving to Kansas. Because then Why? Because then we can get the you know, the Google Internet. The Google, <laughs> for the Google internet for one Whoa. gigabit per second up and down. We can oh, get the Google fiber. penny? Fiber, yeah. <laughs> fiber, yeah. I was just like, we can buy a house just for the internet. <laughs> just We can move <laughs> all the way over there just so that we have an internet. <laughs> just so we have an internet. Have an yeah. internets. We want the interwebs. <laughs> <laughs> no, I, all of it, I, give it I don't know. Now. I don't know. I honestly don't know that I would move that far. <laughs> no, I'm not, not. Kansas just, isn't uh, that too terribly far from from us. No, it, well, it's smack dab in the middle of the country, pretty much. Mm-hmm. Um, but pretty there's not a whole goddamn lot in Kansas. No, there really isn't. Except I'm planet, I'm Captain Kirk. <laughs> yeah, I was gonna say. <laughs> but he's from Iowa. Actually, I found Bill it. Shatner. I found it uh, interesting that uh, in the latest Star Trek movie, Captain Kirk didn't do that. He was fluent. More fluent than Mexicans. He must have had. He must have had an aneurysm. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I tried. Uh... I tried. <laughs> no, I. I was just like, I'm gonna buy. If I win the six hundred million dollars, I was like, I'm gonna buy like a whole bunch of houses right near each other and buy an office building or something along those lines. And anybody that joins the server, they can actually move out. <laughs> oh, that'd be awesome. Then we can do a okay. podcast. Have a mind sanity compound, and we could have a co- yeah, we could have we could have a podcast in person. <laughs> I'm okay with this. <laughs> and then when when people get mad at me, they can just you know throw themselves across you. the table. Yeah, yeah. And, and we can we can have office pranks. Basically, what I'm trying oh to say God. is, I'd, I'd like for us to be rooster teeth. <laughs> I'm okay with this. Like, I, I, would, I would be fine love... with that just for the office pranks. Yeah. <laughs> oh, God. Congratulations, Banjo. You're now playing the role of Gavin. <laughs> what if? Oh. <laughs> oh. British, so. Dang, close enough. You, you ask enough dumb questions. <laughs> um. My mom said the, it the gap. The, I have to say on the podcast that they the, the little game show that they do now, the Gav, Gavin or Google. I have to say that's pretty damn funny. Um, they I take something that what what it is is um, Gavin Free is one of the employees, British, um, that asks a lot of dumb questions, and he they're does. they're not like just dumb. They're brilliantly dumb. Like one of mm-hmm. them was, um, "Can you run faster than your legs?" What? <laughs> and the thinking was is that if you ran faster than your legs, you would fall down because your body was going faster than your legs were. Uh, okay, it just, that, that's actually a decent question. You stated well, horribly. Like the, the, the logic of it is is so like the logic of it is there, but the question itself is so dumb. <laughs> but they do a show like they they take three or four words to be the start of a question. And Gavin gives one answer, and they get an answer from the top answer from Google. 
and they, you know, okay, which this one is one of the questions, this is the other questions, which one is Gavin, which one is Google? Oh, God. <laughs> and That's interesting. <laughs> it's quite hilarious. Um, especially with how, how, how well people get the answers right and how dumb the questions are <laughs> from both sides, both from <laughs> Gavin and from Google. Um, hmm. I just have to uh, take a little pause here. I'm going to throw my, uh, my intercom out the window. I'm fucking sick of that bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Your mom? You're, you're moving. You're moving. Yeah, that's true. Uh, you'll get to the new place, and God damn it, not another one. <laughs> no, knowing, knowing, knowing Texas, it's probably gonna have one built into the wall. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, Here we just have it plugged into the wall. Meh. Oh God, I hate to think of that. Okay, uh. so I, I, I want to kind of test this. What you guys? Um, the phrase starts with "Where can one?" What do you think the first answer is? Where can one uh, eat? I don't know. Yeah, I, mm, I, I don't even want to guess. Yeah, I really stand. Huh? Okay. Well, uh, okay. Okay. Top Google answer then. Yeah. Good job, Google. <laughs> How can I? Top four are keep from singing. Lose weight. What? Keep from keep singing from... lyrics, and get taller. Um. Why? Do, why do people have trouble from <laughs> stopping themselves from singing? I'm... Too many musical movies. You know, too many of those freaking High School Musical. Oh, is it's um. Yeah. It's a Baptist song, uh, Christian uh, hymn. Oh, How can I keep from singing? Is a. Oh. That's why. That's why it's on there. Okay. Um, now you know. And knowing is half the battle. See, you learned so much from the podcast. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Not really. Anyways, I, I, no one got that reference. Wow, I what? am old. I didn't. I didn't hear it. Knowing is half the battle. Oh yeah. It's, I was gonna uh, say I should at least get it. Yeah. It's uh, GI Joe's. Yeah. No, oh, I never liked GI Joe's as a kid. You know, and knowing is half the battle. Yo, Joe! What Boy. the hell was that? That was the cartoon. The cartoon, not the, G. Not, not the piece of shit movie that they made a couple of years ago. No, I, it wasn't. I, it wasn't the movie that was on when I was a kid. It was. It was. Wh it wasn't, wait, whoa, 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 whoa! When you were a what? <laughs> when I was four or five, there was still like an animated series. Yeah, thing. okay. <laughs> and I never liked it. I hated GI Joe's. Ah, blasphemy! <laughs> Yo, well, you're a million years old. Just, just... I, I'm a million years old. How does that? How old does that make six? I guess that makes me Methuselah. <laughs> <laughs> I uh, laugh when I don't know what that is. <laughs> Methuselah? Yeah. How do you know? Uh, uh, according Methuselah. to the Hebrew Bible, Methuselah is purported to be the oldest person to ever live. Yeah. Okay. Um, I mean, come on. At the age, he died Jewish. on the 11th of Sheshvan in the year <laughs> 1656 at the age of 969. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 69. Really? <laughs> That's really? What he that's what he gets out of that. <laughs> 69, oh. And this is why I want to be teamed up with Sigs. <laughs> uh. Yeah, we're going to lose pretty hard. Just just saying. <laughs> pretty hard. Pretty hard. <laughs> I'm banjo. If we're playing, if, if it's an FPS, we are, because I suck. No, 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 no. It's, uh, it's Minecraft PvP. If it is an FPS, then you guys are going to win hands down, because you're with Azrael. Yeah. No, that's yeah. true. Uh, I am I am pretty epic. <laughs> hey, just out of curiosity, have you guys seen this Feed the Beast challenge map? Yes. No. Uh, heard of it, haven't seen it. Jenny B's doing a series, he's running through it. And I guess they did it at PAX. Yeah. Yeah, it was, it was um, I know some details of it. Uh, what they did was they had, I think they had like 700 Alienware computers set up yeah. in yeah. this giant lecture hall. And uh, what they did was they all had Feed the Beast on it. And 
you could use whatever you know whatever uh, resources you could you wanted like YouTube you could you could um look at the wiki and all that but the point was that whoever finished the uh, entire challenge first won I think it was uh, a no, laser it wasn't, keyboard wasn't first. in the it wasn't fastest first. time it was the fastest time fastest yeah. time yeah. yeah well that's first anyway <laughs> that's not first not first quite no, first no. person to complete it yeah, no. they they had a running score of the, of. Um, that's right. That's right. They did multiple multiple rounds. Multiple right. rounds. Yeah, you were yeah. allowed to restart in the middle of it if you really wanted to. Yeah, if you if you felt that it was um, it was not your day. <laughs> but you could and you could also repeat as soon as you finished it. You could yeah. actually start over. It's like okay, yeah. well, now I, can, I have a better understanding of how this works. Let me try it again. Yeah. Yeah, but the uh, the winner, the first place winner, I think, won a Naga keyboard. Hmm. Uh, I think sign. the second. Right. Assigned Naga keyboard by all the Minecraft uh, guys. I a think. bunch of the mine, the Minecrackers and uh, and the uh, FTB team. Yeah. Um, and then also the second place I think won a mouse, and third place I think won a mouse pad. Ooh. The first, Ooh, first, those prize first and second really place. Fast. First and second place got the option of what the what they wanted. So the first one, oh yeah that's right they, it was a mouse or a keyboard and you could choose either one it just so happened first place choose chose the keyboard okay oh well, yeah yeah that's mm -hmm. what I would get yeah and I would never goddamn use it <laughs> <laughs> it would it would get its own display case <laughs> but but it, no it's just interesting because um and, and I bring this up because we're so enthralled with FTB that uh, yeah. I thought it might be an interesting LP well I, I was kind of a, a, a group challenge yeah that's what I'm would, um, so you can get the best time out of all of us yeah well I was thinking more like co-op kind of thing see if we can I, get a really I don't good know time. If, I don't know if you could do that co-op I mean you probably could but put it on a server I don't see why not mm. yeah you could you could do a co-op. Well, I, well I, you know, I, I think that they could do even with vanilla. They could do some better challenge maps. Uh, like I like the time trials ones. I don't know if you guys watched all of my videos uh, from those, but those were loads of fun. That you have thirty minutes oh, yeah. to complete a set of tasks. Yeah, yeah. Oh like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like five five course meal and mm -hmm. um, get a record and all. Yeah, we were things. gonna do we were gonna do more of those. We just never did. Yeah, we didn't. Huh. We never did. And we didn't get. I think I have yeah. a list somewhere of all the different ideas of ones that we could do. Yeah. Um, but we are planning on doing more multiplayer stuff together. We are yeah. um, probably going to be going to play Hidden after this. <laughs> yeah. I'm, I'm good for that. <laughs> um, Sigs, you need to get it. I know, I know, I know, I know. I have a soccer game today, though. So. <laughs> That's all right. Yeah. Um, so uh, I think that's going to probably about wrap it up. We're just about an hour or so. We'll cut it right here. Uh, thank you guys for listening. We hope you enjoyed. Send us questions. Um, give us topic ideas, maybe, or say what's up. Love yeah, you. yeah. As as you can tell, we've we've kind of run out of topics to talk about. And that in the gaming news lately has been kind of slim. Yeah. Um, aside Xbox, from the Xbox whole One, Xbox is, One, and people bitching about it. Yeah, yeah. pretty much. Um, you can search. You can watch porn while searching for more porn. I think Wait, was what? one of the comics that people made about it. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Um, right. it's like, oh, you can play games and surf the internet at the same time, or or watch YouTube videos and surf the internet at the same time. It's like, or you can watch porn and search for more porn at the same time. <laughs> I think Banjo is getting an Xbox now. <laughs> Xbox. No, I would never go near an Xbox. <laughs> he has he has a computer. What would he need? <laughs> exactly. And multiple monitors. I do. I have two monitors. That's definitely on my uh, to buy list. For yeah, un unrelated it, reasons. It's definitely worth getting an extra monitor. Yeah. Really uh, for an LP -er? For an LP -er? Oh Big yes, time. yes, yeah. very much so. Um, so that's gonna wrap it up, guys. Uh, final thoughts, Grave. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I can go back to just later. Yeah, I fucking hate you. <laughs> uh, Banjo, final thoughts. Later. Uh, no. Sigs. Sig Corp signing out. <laughs> and I'll say, I guess, later. <laughs> we have so, majority rules. Uh, thanks again, and we'll see you guys next time. Peace!